Hi everyone, here's a quick video of what I found when I went metal detecting on Saturday night. Uh, it was a much better hunt than the night before, as I found a silver ring, um, $7 of spendable cash, um, some pennies, uh, yeah, but getting ahead of myself, so first of all, um, here's the ring I found. So it's sterling silver, and the coolest thing about it is that it's a Lord of the Rings ring, silver ring, um, and it's a copy of the one ring. So it's got elvish on the inside and on the outside. So it obviously says one ring to rule them all, one ring to bind them, blah blah blah. Um, but it's made by um, MLP Incorporated, which is uh, the same people that do the Weta Workshop rings, which um, cost around 180 bucks brand new. So that's pretty cool. Uh, definitely a keeper. I uh, had no idea I'd ever find a Lord of the Rings ring, so again, this is why I like this hobby, is because you just never know what you're going to get from the ground. So that's awesome to find the Lord of the Rings ring. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. And yeah, seven dollars of uh, spendable cash, which goes towards petrol and whatnot. Save up for a pin pointer, and also found um, three English pennies: one 1920, 1937, and 1938. Found a Commonwealth of Australia one penny from 1921, and an Australian penny from 1940, and two New Zealand pennies 1943 and 1944. Also found uh, English half penny from 1938, um, and a New Zealand half penny. It's hard, can't really read the date on that one. And found an old ten cent coin. Six two cent coins, uh, six one cent coins, one one cent been hit by lawnmower, and two halves of the of a penny that had been hit by a, a lawnmower. Also found a junk heart pendant, it's pretty junky, and also found another dart. The second data found, made in England. This one's in probably better nick. Yeah, so I'm stoked with what I found. It was a two hour hunt. And yeah, I'm stoked with this ring. Um, hopefully I can one day find a, a gold Lord of the Rings one ring. But I'll stick with the silver one for now. So yeah, please like this video, uh, please subscribe to Kiwi Metal Detecting and as always, happy hunting!